Yo, what's going on? Sexy Simulon is quite a day. We're here doing a rank 1v1, and I am playing. Um, basically, I'm doing Smite the Movie. Now, if you don't know what that means, it means I'm doing an hour and a half video uh, because I haven't done a tryhard Thursday in a while, so I figured it's best. Hold on. It's best to um, <clears throat> go ahead and pump out some some recordings that are an hour long because you guys have been asking for them and I have not been complying. So that's, you know, that's my mistake, my bad. I really, really enjoy, I was going to say like, but like isn't a strong enough word. I enjoy um, recording these videos because it's just me, you know, sitting here for an hour, in this case an hour and a half, just playing a game that I love playing and uh, like really trying to, or not trying, but like hanging out with y'all. It's really cool and quite honestly, it's probably my most fun day of recording. Just playing whatever I want to play, picking anything I want and just hanging out for an hour. I enjoy it a lot. Oh, I thought that would hit him. This was a mistake. I should not have ran that way. I put myself in danger. Danger of the big old death. We got his beats. I'll take it. I'll take it. That's pretty good. Beads down. And we're up just in time for the red buff. He should not be able to afford his Bancrofts. Unless he sells his potions. Or he's staying for this wave, which means he guarantees lose red. Which is fine by me. Okay. That was a weird play. I don't know why he would ult that, unless he was really like desperately trying to get my my beads out of me, so he could kill me when he finally gets back. But I knew he hadn't backed yet, right? So what? Okay, that was bullshit. I I was literally in the air taking damage from the thing on the ground, so that was. You know, <laughs> that was kind of bullshit, but... Unless he was desperately trying to get my beads for when he comes back with Bancrofts, he can just kill me. Which I think is definitely what was going on. I'm big bad, dude. Alright. He wrapped me. I know I probably should not have used my beads in that case, but it did give me a kill. I used my beads literally just because um, it guarantees me a kill if I'm not CC'd right there. And it's bad to use beads in that scenario because of the fact that now if he wraps me, I'm just dead. So it makes a return kill very possible. Um, but at the same time, like, come on though. How, can I, how do you fucking do this, dude? 
Oh, like that. Okay. Well, took a while, but I learned. Um, I could die very easily. Death comes from every shadow. One rap and I'm dead. I'm trying to push my luck a little bit and get this last 300 gold before I actually back. I think I might just ult this wave, if I'm completely honest. All right, that gives us a full transcendence now. I'm giving up red buff, but that's fine. Also, we're about 45 seconds off of being able to not get instantly killed by the first ability that hits me, which is a wrap, by the way. This is stressful, man. I'm stressed out. Sweating bullets. Yeah, red buff. My alt is 40 seconds out. Your blue up? No. My XP camp just came up though. I was gonna jump on him, but then I realized that would probably get me killed, and I didn't do it. Actually, I do have beads up. I can get his beads if I alt him here. Damn, damn, I want pestilence actually. I'm gonna run straight for the tower because I don't want to lose all the XP. I missed most of it. That's pretty bad. I fucked up my ult. I went to cut him off with the ult and he just completely juked it. Completely juked the ult. Damn, dude. Damn, Daniel. Next relic is going to be Aegis for beats which overall is definitely not bad oh he didn't even back he just ran around It's like fucking Freddy Krueger, he's just running at me. He's got no mana.
All right. That red still available for? Nope. Okay. You aren't Sam. I don't want to start a collection here. Okay. <laughs> I mean, he typed in my name in order to send that message, which means it pretty clearly is me. But, uh, you know, that's what it is, I guess. He doesn't build defense. On the contraire, my friend. I do against Anubis. Just fuck that god, dude. Aegis. Nice. How did he know to juke that way? How did he know? Man is playing me. Oh, that really almost killed him. Man, I need more anti heal. I suck. Please don't, please don't, please don't like so, please don't like still. Oh! Oh my god. That was the most botched garbage kill I've ever gotten in my life. Holy crap. Woo 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 woo. <sighs> Can I please back? There we go. Um, toxic blade. One of each poche hall. And then, oh, where do I go? 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 Hmm. Or just an executioner. Or honestly, I don't think Crit would be bad. He doesn't have thorns or hide. So I could straight up actually go Crit Chance. Damn, I kind of like, I kind of feel like I don't do that much damage to him. And again, I didn't miss most of my garbage there, so. I jumped. Got it, nice, easy. Okay. So he's gonna life steal up to full HP somewhere else on the map. I'm just gonna back. I don't wanna deal with you. Let's go XE. I do actually think Crit Chance would be better. Genuinely, because he isn't that tanky and he doesn't have thorns. So I think I might switch it up. Uh, okay.
He has ult, doesn't he? Uh, I'm dead. Oh, not that easy. Really thought he had ult there. I keep missing all this. Okay, nice. Can I get his Phoenix with a mostly killed wave? Probably not. Wish that were not the case. But it is. I think I'm gonna sell this for crit. I really I really do think that it's not a bad play. Don't have much of an eye for weapons. Just because his build his build doesn't make sense. I mean his build does make sense, but it doesn't make sense not to go crit against. You know? Like you should just you just punch him in the head. He only has what like 140? Yeah. Then there's 140. And I have... I take that down to 120. Less than 120. I think 119 technically. Which will... Uh, do a lot for me. chance was slightly higher. Nice. Alright. Crit chance is actually working out pretty nicely. 8 autos for 1500. That doesn't happen without crit chance. I mean, unless you're doing a whole lot of damage, I guess. But I'm not. I'm pretty much just relying on crit chance. Can I win here is the question. I don't think so. Because like I said, I really don't do that much damage. I'm just relying on crit. Oh, he just quit. Oh, okay. GG, man. Thanks for watching the vids. Fuck! I did the same thing in Discord earlier, too. Someone sent me a message that was a heart. I went to go send a heart back, and I did, I did a backwards one. Looks like a fucking penis head with a weird... Oh, I, you know what? It kind of looks like the head of a penis going into... A butt. Uh, uh. Anyways. Damn it, dude. I just missed the queue. It's a full three minute queue. What is this? Why is www a quest? Okay. Um, weird. So there's been people asking me a lot in the comments if I've seen the um I should have said this in the beginning because most people skip the in-betweens, but um But no, the Avatar Battle Pass, I think, is, well, first off, it's fucking sick. It's really cool that they would do that. But apparently it is true, because um, so many people on Twitter, let me go on Twitter and see if Smite has debunked it. Twitter, um, Smite Game. Just might said anything about it. 
It's my game. Um, no, there's no... There's nothing that Smite Game tweeted out that would prove it wrong. But apparently a lot of people have made videos about it. And um, Smite having an avatar thing, which is so sick. I Avatar is the coolest thing. If, if they make, if they actually make that, an, an avatar battle pass, I don't fucking know, bro. It, it, it would be so cool. It would actually be sick as fuck. Um. Okay. Hold on, I'm watching this video. I'm watching this video. the fuck <laughs> what's going on dude <laughs> see this is a switch yeah yeah i put the light on this switch yeah is a light switch Ooh! okay <laughs> hold on i put the light on this switch yeah is a light switch Ooh! no 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 take me with you don't leave me don't leave me Oh, huh? Is yeah. it mean it made? Eh? Yeah, yeah. Give it to the man. Now he's man made. Eh? Oh! <laughs> 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 it's a game. Uh huh. I put it on my boy. Uh huh. It's a game boy. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> that's that's actually so great, dude. That's so great, dude. <laughs> Oh man. Oh man, that made me happy. <clears throat> that made me happy. I take the game. I put it on my boy. <laughs> I have a game boy. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Smite the movie. Everybody, smite the movie. I mean, let's be honest, right? When you're when you go into the movies, you're like let's, let's see Let's say you go to see a like a cop movie, right? And they're they're always doing like actiony shit, you know, like going in, busting in, like pew pew, motherfucker, you know, like they're always doing cool shit. And then you're a cop in real life, and you're just like doing paperwork most of your time, you know. <laughs> like, it's kind of the same thing with Smite, you know. You watch a video, and it's always like bang bang, frags, kills. Yo, sick builds, counter building, intelligent gameplay, you know? But then when you're really playing the game, half of the time you're just sitting in queue and banning, you know? <laughs> it's kind of the same thing when you really think about it. So in this movie, in Smite the Movie, directed by yours truly, Sam Dude, um, <clears throat> I'm taking out the whole hero aspect and I'm bringing in the whole, this is normally, this is how Smite is. This, this is real smite. This shirt is really big on me, by the way. Like, it's actually fucking gigantic. Um, so it, it kind of makes me look like a like a whale. Or like a parachute man. Almost. But, um... <clears throat> is what it is, I suppose. Let's... Oh, God, Heimdall is open. I'm not playing Heimdall. I know people want to see me play Heimdall. But I don't want to play Heimdall. I'm going to play Scylla. What the fuck is this? Oh, I have a new spell to show you. I don't like this at all. I'm gonna play it because it's a new skin. But it seems awful. Oh, it's a Kerninos. Kerninos. <laughs> um, I'm gonna do a conquest build actually. I don't I don't really want to start I don't really want to start with I go Bracer or Beads here. Let me go Bracer. Beads is good for his ult, but I don't know if I'll need it. 
Because I can just alt it. And then run away. Because I'll be fast and shit, you know? Ebu! They'll know when enemies are close. Did that- whatever I just threw with my one, did it literally fart when I threw it? Is that the noise I heard? Save my two for the wave, use my one for this. I should've gotten two health bots instead of two mana bots, by the way, if I'm doing mana buff. That was, like, actually stupid. Alright. Ouch. 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 Um, not bad. He's got hella pots, though. He got so many health pots. And he's got his healing stance, so... Oh, my autos are out of sync. That feels really bad. Hmm. I'll use a mana pot here. He's killing his boys, so I'll kill mine. Put the game on my boy. I got a game boy. We're kind of chilling, honestly. We're just chilling, we're just chilling, we're chilling, we're chilling. Alright. I hate the sound effects in this skin. Can I just be honest? Despise them. Oh, I got one. And I hit him. Nice. Obviously, my wave clear is going to be a little bit lack because of that decision, but... Actually, never mind. Still doing pretty good. You gonna dash? That's what I expected. Backpedaling is a bad thing to do. thought that was gonna get him. Nice dash, nice dash. Oh! Holy shit. What? They were targeting the tower. They already were shooting at the tower. I saw the arrows hit my tower, and then I walked up to clear the wave, and they just retargeted me? That's not how that's supposed to go at all. Minions shouldn't ever just retarget. That's kind of whack. I'm 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 upset about that one. I'll be honest. I'm upset about that one. That one should not have happened. I mean, I do decent damage, but I just don't have, like, secure, you know? Oh, shit. Good dash, good dash. Can I kill him? get the kill on him. I kind of am not doing that much damage yet. That's alright though. Okay. 
I'm clearing waves decent, which is pretty much the only thing I need to care about at the moment. Alright, this turns into a Spear of Deso, because damage. Okay, that was that was definitely not the play, dude. I root here and then all you Aegis, you don't Aegis. That's weird. Why didn't he Aegis? Oh shit. Okay. Uh, I was waiting for him to make a misplay there. So basically I just hold my abilities until he fucks up. <laughs> and it worked. <laughs> it's it's extremely risky to do a play like that. Because if they don't if they just don't do anything, you die. You know? But thank thankfully he uh he made a not so great play and I ended up getting a fatty dub for it. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. So I get my 10% extra cooldown here from Mage's Blessing. Hmm. I actually did want to take. Yeah, fuck it. Why did he do that? Why why did he dash in on me there? This guy is kind of crazy with his dash. Like he just you he just throws it out there. I don't really know if that's the play. Your team has destroyed a middle enemy tower. The bombs have excellent hearing. No when enemies close. Uh Oh gosh, okay. He had tier 1 defense. And it did a lot more than I thought it would. Plus he ages my ult, which was a good play. Alright, we got the Phoenix to about half HP. Chasing. Nice, no, comfortable. Away. Okay, let's go get. Here's the thing, right? Chronos Pendant seems in very enticing because it does so much damage, and it caps out my cooldown already, which would be awesome. Um, so I'm gonna do that. Breastplate would be better, like a hundred percent. Breastplate would be better because it also caps out my cooldown, but it also gives me defense. But I think I'm just gonna go mid guardian. As my defensive in this game. Not going for red buff, huh? Alright. I do a lot of damage, man. Let's see. Pick this up. And then we fight, I guess. He... How long is he? Just 180? 120? So he won't have Aegis for my, for my alt if I root him here. Oh, 
Yep, saw the dash coming from a mile away. Nice. Nice. Alright. He uh he preemptively ulted. He got really spooked. I got minions coming. We should be able to get the Phoenix here, I think. Well, I don't know. My minion wave is kinda scuffed. Maybe. Oh shit. He had blink, dude. He got blink. <laughs> oh, fuck. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. Well played. Well played. I didn't see the blink coming. Polly will be really nice as well. He, does, he doesn't have any anti here, right? No, nor is he building into NT. NT? Any. Um, so let's go Polly. Couple of pots. Does he get tower here? If he stands that close, he might not. I can do the good old... Oh no, he got it, okay. Whatever. Alright. Oh shit. Oh shit, dude. Oh my god, I just lost Phoenix. I actually just lost my Phoenix. Having no defense is definitely an issue. Wow, he shreds that thing. Ah, oh, fuck, dude. Oh, God. Okay, minions cut. I need to get his Phoenix off of this. Phoenix losing Phoenix sucks, but it's much worse for him because he's not me. Like me as in Scylla, like my character, because he has a lot harder time clearing wave than I do. We got an Aussie. I kind of don't want to go poly if I'm honest. I kind of want to go Soul Reaver or something. It doesn't have that much HP though, so I am going to go poly, but I don't know if that's the best play. And then I'm going to go... Soul Reaver, 10% pen. Gives me... Where's my pen? 15 base pen and 10% actual pen. He doesn't have that much defense, so I think that's enough, actually. Oh, you know what? Actually, we go Divine here. 100% Divine. Because he's got Aussie. And I just saw how much that's actually doing for him. thought he was going to run after me there. Oh, fuck. He wants to heal, dude.
I still have my Phoenix up. He's life stealing, man. He always has that fucking dash, man. So annoying. Always has that fucking life steal too. It's all right. I can get my divine now. I farmed up enough for divine. He farmed up for something nice too. I have max cooldown, so I guess going blue buff isn't really important to me. I'll pick up this because I don't think I'll be able to get speed. What do you get? Crusher? I mean, that's not really that smart, honestly. I really thought, for whatever reason, he had Aegis up. But he didn't? My Phoenix is fine, don't worry. I have Polynomicon, which is why I'm doing this. Phoenix down, boys. Phoenix down. On each of all last item. by me, I guess. Well, oh, that actually hit him. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. He was not expecting that ult to hit him. I mean, I wasn't either, though, to be fair. Alright. <clears throat> GG, man. Holy shit. That was a roughin. GG Gamer. Pimacorn. Pimarkin. 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 Play again. Short Q. GG, gamer guy. Oh, thanks so much, man. Keep doing you. I'll do my best. I'm currently recording Smite the movie. <laughs> See what he has to say about that one. Love it. <laughs> Thanks, man. He played pretty well. I think... I mean, him not alting... Or not alting, sorry. Him not Aegising my last alt or my... Well, not my last alt. My second to last alt, where I got his Phoenix, or my very last alt. Um, him not Aegising those. I don't know if he had Aegis up. But... Him not aging those was a pretty big misplay, but other than that, I mean, his fighting was good. He sustained well. Um, his build was pretty good. I don't like the crusher in your build. I would have gone with uh, beat stick because even though I didn't have Bancroft, I did have Polynomicon and Boots, which is twenty percent life steal because Poly gives twelve and um, Boots give eight. So it's still a pretty significant amount of life steal, especially when I'm hitting for like a thousand damage with my alt. You know. When I'm hitting for a thousand, I'm getting 200 HP back and one ability. That's pretty crazy. 
Not to mention if I ult a wave and you, I'm healing like my entire HP bar back, you know? So it's a little rough not having any kind of anti-heal. Maybe like a Toxic Blade instead of a, a Crusher or a Beat Stick instead of Crusher. I just don't think Crusher was that good. It does give 25% lifesteal, or sorry, 25% uh, attack speed, which is good. But if you wanted attack speed, you could have just gone Toxic Blade, which gives 30% and 100 HP um, and 40% anti-heal. So, yeah, I just think, I don't know. Crusher is good, but not on, not on, in that scenario. Personally speaking. <clears throat> Anyways, um, hey, if you guys are watching this video, I'll either be taking a nap or I'll be live streaming on Twitch. Here, I'll, I'll type I'll type it out for you. I'll type it out for you, boss. Twitch.tv slash send the dude. You type that into your URL, you press enter. It doesn't say that I'm not authorized. Instead, it takes you to the website where I'm live streaming at, and I'm like, hey. You know, doing all this weird shit. Probably not playing Smite, because I'm doing a uh, variety stream today. I already announced it. I'm going to be playing a bunch of different games, hopefully. As well as I'm going to be streaming for a long time overnight. Uh, because I'm doing an overnight shift type scenario at the moment. Um, so, yeah. So, yeah. Sick. Sick, bro. What's ban is an army? Who you banning? Who you banning? Who you banning? Who you banning? Anubis? Alright, I can fuck with that. I'll ban Scotty. Who you banning? Kali? Alright. Weird ban. I'll take it. Who you banning? Bakasura? Well, this really this guy doesn't like uh, auto attack assassins. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna play an auto attack assassin. You damn, you damn right. I'm gonna play an auto attack assassin. Ban Persephone, Persephone. All right, Persephone. You ban the Habo, Habo. Auto attack assassin, Arachne. Itty bitty, Itty bitty Arachne. I played this matchup. Actually, no, it wasn't this matchup. I played a different matchup, but I fought an Arachne. And it was incredibly difficult. With the new Golden Blade, Arachne's actually strong. Are we gonna have a jump party? I love jumping! I love jumping! Alright. Um. Do this. <coughs> Wait for the cooldown. Do it again. And then we back. Get our mana back. And then we do it again. Gives us really fast clear with no mana usage. Which means pretty much, um, we're gonna be good to good to fight right when the wave meets. Hopefully, I got my spider bros hitting them up. I don't need to use my one. I'll use my one on the wave. So. We're saving mana that way. While also clearing incredibly quick. Ooh, good damage on him, dude. Really good damage. He's going Golden Blade. I wonder if he saw my video and that's why. That was a bit of a mistake, dashing back towards me when I had everything up. Pretty big mistake. I can get my Golden Blade already. Did I take a tower shot there? Oof, not cool. Ooh, wow, he took a lot of damage. Ooh! Good kills, good kills, good kills. Good kills, man, hell yeah. <clears throat> now... 
I clear this wave and finish my golden blade. I'm level six, he's level four. God damn. Damn, I just realized I have two kills, a finished Golden Blade, and tier two boots before Red Buff even spawns. The first time. I didn't use my two because I expected him to run away a lot quicker, but he never did, so I kind of look like an idiot for not using my two. Alright, he shouldn't be able to get this, so I'm just gonna full commit. He just backed. Alright, alright, alright. Clear out this wave, and then we go back and get our attack speed boots. Actually, we should get the blue buff first, and then we'll back, get our attack speed boots, and then do the speed buff on the way back. Yeah, Arachne is pretty strong now, man. Arachne is pretty damn strong now. The Golden Blade buff made so many people so much stronger. Like, because... It doesn't take three minutes into the game to afford it anymore. You afford it within a minute, so you can actually compete with clear after the first two or three waves, you know? As opposed to the first five or six waves you're getting pretty much double the farm in the early game makes it very strong god damn bro not to mention the 20 percent attack speed instead of 15 percent on golden blade you really do feel it like genuinely you feel it I was scared he was going to try to fight me there, which is why I was super silent and just wanted to run over there immediately and start healing off the minis. Alright, let's go start our stone cutting sword. Wow, start our stone cutting sword. There's a lot of s s s s sounds in that one. Red buff spawns really soon. Let's just run straight over there, honestly. Look at the minis. While we're at it. Not here? Oh, he's at the wave. Okay. Alright, cool. Hi. I probably could have killed him there. And I probably should have killed him there, but... Eh... Whatever, it's okay. I'm far enough that ahead that I don't have to worry about killing him if I can just efficiently farm. I do absolutely get the tower here though. He's so speedy, Gonzalez. God damn, dude. The burst damage. The burst damage. Of the Iraq thing is so insane, it's absolutely fucking incredible damage. Absolutely fucking incredible damage. That's alright, that's alright, that's alright, that's alright, that 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 that's alright, that's alright, that's alright, that's alright. Boo doo doo doo. GG bro. He left already. Bummer. And it's a full full timer queue. It's a full time queue. <laughs> God damn it. <sighs> um Event. Cthulhu Summer Sale. Cthulhu is calling for crazy low prices. 
get up to 33% off gem packs, up to 50% off of class chests, 50% off voice packs, more all week long, and three times worshippers all weekend long. Does the weekend start today? Yeah, that was 20 worshippers. That was 20 worshippers for a five minute duel. Maybe I go, where are my gods? Hold on, let me go, how do I go to my player thing? Well, first off, if you don't know, I have 49 diamond gods. I kind of play the game a lot. It's kind of my thing. So let's go to worshipers. Scroll down. Next up is soul. Eh. I don't really have that much fun playing soul. I have fucking Ymir at rank 6. Um, I could easily get a rank 5 to a diamond over the weekend. Easily. But I would but who do I want to play all weekend long? I wouldn't mind playing Rob. You got those good ass snipes. They're fun to watch. Fun to watch. Oh Rob. Oh, I already have him diamond. God damn it. Um Hun Bats if I'm playing ranked. Zeus if I'm playing ranked. In conquest that is. Hmm. Who's my lowest worshipper god? Mulan, Baba Yaga, Cthulhu. Alright, one Mulan game, I get her ranked. Two Baba Yaga games, I get her ranked. Two Cthulhu games, I get him ranked. Assuming they're longer than five minutes, which they have to be in, in casuals, I think. So, um, Yeah. Yikes. Yamoja's OP. I like playing Yamoja, but... I don't know if I like her enough to play her from rank 1 to diamond in one weekend, you know? That seems a little bit too much. Um, I could do Dick Sordia. Hera would be easy to get diamond. Chalk would be easy, except for the fact that I don't think you could pick him right now. <laughs> um... Pele would be super easy in duel, so it is Anami. I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out though. Cthulhu looks sick. What other skins are there? Presidential Punisher. I played that skin. It's really cool actually. That's actually a really cool skin. I may make a separate video just on that skin. Um The Sin of Greed. That's a Fafnir skin? That kind of looks sick as fuck, dude. I should then, uh, hold on, I'm going to screenshot this and send it over to Thug, because he plays Fafnir a lot. So, boop. See if Thug wants to play Fafnir. New Fafnir skin, thought you'd like to see it. This is a cool skin, I played that one. And then the, this is a Ymir skin, right? New Ymir skin in Grim Omens. I own all of these, by the way, because I, I bought this for the Hoi skin a while ago. Well, I didn't buy it. I asked Hi-Rez to give me the gems, and they gave it to me. And then I bought it. <laughs> um, but yeah, so I have all those skin, skins, which is really cool. Oh, Doug responded already? Yeah, I got to peek it out when I was watching your fucked up dual stream. Oh, with, well, with the five second respawn timers. <laughs> yeah, that was that was super fucked. That was super fucked. All right, I got to ban Uller here. I could play Uller. Hmm. Could also just play Hun Bats. Soul was the closest to Diamond, I believe, though, yeah? I don't know. I'm banning Uller next ban. Let's see. Who do I play? Who does he not like playing against? He banned four mages. Which means he doesn't like playing against mages. Which means I'm going to play a mage. I could play Baba Yaga. To try to get her ranked. I could play Zeus. 
Get him rank 7. Uh, I could just play Soul. Soul did get buffed, actually. You know what? Let's see if we can feel the Soul buff. Because she... Um, I, went, I think she went from her passive giving her 20% power in her auto attacks to now giving 25% power, which 5% scaling on an auto attack is fucking huge. Like, <laughs> let's. so most, when you're playing soul, normally I'd say you cap your build out around 5 to 600 power. You're getting, you know, what is that? 10% of 600 is 60, so 5% is 30. You're getting an extra 30 damage on your auto. You know, an extra 5% damage on your auto. And an extra 30 damage per auto when you're shooting that shit out at 2.5 attack speed as a mage is is a lot. It's kind of a lot. Oh, shit. Oh, oh dicks inside her, dude. And no, I'm not talking about penises inside her. I'm talking about dicks inside her. Shout out, Lonely Island. Um, I think we just start Bancroft. I think it's probably just the best play. Against Freya? <coughs> probably going to go Shell and then upgrade it pretty early. I think it might be the best play. It might be the greatest play of all fucking time. Okay, he's doing his buff. I think I do mine faster than him, actually. Yeah, I definitely do. He's still doing it. God dang. Ooh, good damage. Damn. Good damage. Good damage. <laughs> All right, he's probably gonna yoink me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Expect a yoink. Expect a yoink. I don't know why he wanted to hurt me so bad when he now will not get any of the gold for the wave. Uh, I think he got one of them. That's all right though. Ooh, that actually hit him. Alright. Do I back, though, is the question? Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I really do think, actually, that... I could have killed him there. But I get the red buff for free. Alright. Not bad. Not bad. It could be way worse. Could be way worse. <clears throat> so he he started with the hunter's blessing which means his late game is going to be better than mine but my early game is better than his 
And he's Freya, so I think no matter what, his late game is always going to be better than mine, honestly. So I'm kind of cool with it. I accept. Alright. I guess he's doing his blue now. Oh, nice. I actually got it. That's kind of huge, because I did a lot of tower damage. He sacrificed his tower damage in order to secure his blue. And I did a lot of tower damage and got his blue, so that's really bad for him. And I definitely have better fight than him right now, because... Well, I have a Bancroft and he doesn't, so... I can kind of just do whatever the hell I want, honestly. This is a really, really good start for me. A really, really good start for me. We go back, and I think we go, uh... Lifesteal Boots, I don't think we really care about cooldown. Most of our damage is going to be coming up from auto attacks anyways. And now I think I either build... What do I want here? I want attack speed. I want anti-heal, and I want defense. I can't get all of them in one item. I can get two of them in one item. I either go defense and anti-heal, or I go attack speed and anti-heal. Oh, he actually backed before doing these. This is a really weird, like, backing schedule, you know? Like, <laughs> he, he backs at the worst times possible. Damn, because of that that poorly timed back, he lost his minis and the red buff. And gold from the wave as well. I'm doing I'm doing really good right now. I'm over 1,000 gold ahead. And um, a whole level ahead as well. And I haven't even killed him. It's just from out farming him. But I kind of have to play like this. Not, like, I'm not really playing annoying, I'm just playing very farm heavy, because he's Freya, you know? Good juke. Alright, I got the Bancrofts online, so I'm not scared of you. Alright, there's the alt. Your team has destroyed a metal oh wow, that actually killed, holy shit. Can I get Phoenix off that? No, I can't. I can't half HP the Phoenix though. Damn, we're six minutes in and I have the Phoenix half HP. He should not have turned around, that was a big misplay. Big misplay, big misplay. Um, I think I go... Uh, what do I want? I probably want Sprint. Yeah, I probably want Sprint to try to get away from him. And I go either Toxic Blade or Pestilence here. I'm me and I'm winning, so I'm definitely going Toxic Blade instead of Pestilence. I don't like going defense while I'm winning. Because it's kind of unfun. If you if like If I just build Pestilence here, there's nothing you can do. It just wouldn't be a fun game. If I was climbing for, like, leaderboard rank or something, or I cared about that at all, then yes, I would, but I don't, so. Uh, I'll pick this up. I'm starting to feel a little bit mana-heavy here. Good slow. Okay. He ulted. Alt down, alt down. That's pretty good. Um, I can do bull demon here, I think. I really don't do a lot of damage, but... 
he just backed, so I think we're good. Wow. He literally surrendered right when I got bull demon. <laughs> right when I got bull demon, he just fucking quit. He gave up. What a dork. <laughs> what a fucking dork. Alright, GG, man. <laughs> a one MMR. Dude, I'm getting one MMR out of every game today, and you can't stop me. Damn, 20 worshippers, man. How long was that game? Eight minute game, 20 worshippers. Dude, you could grind. In ranked duel, if someone just F6 for you, um, if someone just F6 for you after every game at five minutes, you get 20 worshippers every five minutes. That's like a that's a really fast diamond god. Like you could go, I could get fucking um, Cthulhu diamond if people just surrendered five minutes in and I got twenty worshippers. Triple worshippers, crazy. And then if I popped, wait a second, I could pop a worshipper booster because I have a thousand million of them and get forty worshippers. Does that work like that? Is that how that works, or or am I mistaken? Because it's it's doubled, and then it's doubled again because it's tripled, and that's why it's normally five. They doubled it for double worshippers, which puts me at ten. And then they doubled it again, which puts me at twenty. And then if I doubled it again, would it be forty? Would I get forty worshippers every five minutes? Is that how that works? Holy shit, hold on. I have someone... Hey, I'm recording, and I have a question. Can I call you for, like, one second? Sure. Okay, perfect. Is this for a stream? Uh, re recording. Yes, you'll be live. <laughs> I call him an idiot. I don't know. Hey, what's up? Hello? Hello? What's up, dude? Hey, okay, so I have a question. What's going on? Um, I, I just finished a five minute duel game and I got 20 worshippers because it's triple worshipper. And I have a question about how the worshippers work. I'm probably not the best person to answer that. I'm not super familiar with the factor in there. Okay, well, I was just wondering. I, it's not like a crazy question. Does triple worshippers means your original worshipper gets doubled because of double worshipper? And then does it get doubled again? Or does only the five or the initial think, worshipper gets added? I think it's three three times the base. I think. I'm not. Three times the base. Because I, I just finished an 8 minute duel game and got 20 worshippers, which I think normally would give me 5, but then it doubled to 10 and then it doubled to 20. I think. Yeah, so it's, I think it's triple on top of base. Triple on top of base. So yeah. so on I got 5, and then 5 times 3 is 15, so then it was just 5 plus 15? I think that's the way it works. So if I added a worshipper boost... Like a two times worshiper boost, I wouldn't get forty. I would it's get. It's afterwards, yeah. Order of operations, it would be. Um, I think it's worshiper plus worshiper uh, multiplier plus worshiper boost. Okay. So I would get. If I added a, if I added a two times worshiper boost, I would just get twenty five instead of. Instead of twenty, I wouldn't get forty. You would get ten plus fifteen. You get twenty-five. I think so. Okay, I'm gonna. I am. On I'm, that. I'm um, gonna try it this game. Okay. Okay. Thanks for answering. That's all I wanted to ask. All right. Peace, man. Bye. <laughs> all right. Cool.
So we learned how that works, which is nice. At least that's what we think. That's how we think it works. Nobody, I guess I guess he doesn't really know how it works, but that's how he thinks it works. But we'll see. I mean, we'll find out. Um, ban Hoi. Nemesis ban, eh? Ban this guy. Who do I have open that's super annoying still? Hera, Hebo. I think it's ban Hebo. Um, I'm just gonna play Arachne again. Itty bitty Arachne. I already, I already played that skin, so we'll do. No, I'll keep the skin. Fuck it. Fuck it. Steven Fire. Boom. <laughs> All right, again, let's make sure we get there quick. I put two points into my three instead of two points into my one like an idiot. He messaged, he said, sorry, bro. I'm not super familiar with the factoring. It's all right, man. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Just a question. I didn't expect you to know the in detail mathematics behind it all. I hate that I put two points into my three here, but that's all right. My little, uh, my spider boys tanked for me, actually, which is really nice. There are still things my many eyes can't He's see. double buffing this because he is Bakasura, which is actually better for me, I think, because I have such bad clear. Um, that I think it's okay that he's double buffing. Okay, he leveled and got his jump. Is it bad that I kind of, I kind of like the, um, the spiders being level two? I actually think it's kind of strong. Does he have 5 here off his wave? I think he does. Okay. Damn. He's ulting this. Just getting my movement speed buff, no big deal. Slow down the minis, or the minions as well. Not bad for me, not bad for me at all. Ultimate down. Have my uh, my little spider boys tank up a little bit for me. Oh, he's actually just jumping away. That's not something you see often. Alright, let's go back. That's fine. That's fine. We'll grab this, and we'll grab this. And we'll head straight to the red buff, because I don't think he got it. He's a little bit too lo low HP, actually. Is he backing right now? Yeah, he is. Okay. So actually, because I have Golden Blade, I think I'll clear this wave first. My clear should be pretty good. And I think he's starting Golden Blade as well. He went Attacker or Assassin's Blessing. I don't know if... Um, Red buff or attack speed buff is actually better in this scenario here. I'm fine with this. I am fine with this. It's not up yet. Big guy. Let's make 
Oh, my fucking... My thing didn't go off fast enough. My alt. Damn, that's really shitty. Your middle tower is I get. I should have bracered before alting that, but... I really didn't think it mattered. I thought my alt would go off regardless. Damn. That sucks. There's been a lot of people recently actually going um, Assassin's Blessing in Duel. Alright. I think that's okay, actually. I think that's okay. He has a lot of gold, but... Um, I got kind of a comeback kill there, which is important. <laughs> yeah, the, the 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 person from high res that I called, he asked the developers of the game and he said they aren't sure either. <laughs> it's pretty funny actually. Yep. Knew he was gonna alt that, so no big deal. No big deal. Not in the best scenario right now, am I? Ah, uh, damn. Actually, I was in a pretty good scenario. Damn. Okay. Just get the red buff and then, uh... Do we back out here or no? I don't really want to if I'm honest. He does heal like a whole lot. So I actually am going to back out. That Assassin's Blessing is doing a lot of work for him, surprisingly. I guess my blue buff is back up. Probably gonna ult. Not ulting. Sounds good to me, brother. See you later. Alright, um... I'm not going to go full HP here because I want to make sure that I get my speed buff. That Assassin's Blessing is really like, it's giving him so much sustain. We got Stone Cutting now, which is huge. And I'll pop Thorns as well. When he ults me, I'll fight him back. Um, I don't think I need beads. He got Toxic Blade. <sighs> That's strong. The full fucking item, too. And one back. Hmm. 
All right, we're safe for now. Oh, come on. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it, pump. Pump, 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 damn it, pump, pump, damn it, damn it, pump, pump. Damn it, damn it, pump, damn it, damn it, pump, pump. Oh, dumb, pump, pump, dumb, dumb. I'm gonna fall on fucking Hod Hodor there. Hodor! Alright. Let's go Toxic Blade. Because uh, he has healing and bracer just like I do. Arguably, he has more healing than I do because his cooldown is lower. Um, I go Toxic Blade, and then I go Defense, and then I probably, after that, go sh just go straight Ichival, maybe, is the play. If I were him, I would go Ichival right now. He doesn't need Stone Cutting, I don't think. Going Defense. Good play, too. Alright. He lived, bro? Oh, that is so not cool. That is so not cool, man. Um... I don't understand what that was. I don't know why he did that. But whatever, I'll take it. I think he was trying to jump and he glitched out or something. Okay. Toxic Blade. Uh, breastplate, probably. That was a great kill, a great kill. It's a little bit poopy, but it ain't that poopy, you know? Slightly poopy, but not the biggest poopy it could be. does run at me very fast. Um Your middle tower is under He has a lot of attack speed. Your middle tower has been destroyed. More than me. Whatever, I can burn this, right? Okay. He backed. Well. I don't know why he would back there. I personally would not. Unless can he make it back here in time? I feel like he can't. Yeah, I didn't think he could. 
But AFC doesn't care. We both use both relics, so it's a wash in terms of relic usage. No big deal. He alts this right here, probably. He just turns back around, so I'm not even gonna fuck with it. Did those hit me? He can't fight me, dude. I have 2,000 gold in hand, and he's spending all of it, and he still can't fight me. That's rough. That is rough. Grab speed buff pretty much just for the movement. That's all I want. We're over an hour and a half, by the way. This is officially movie length. Smite the movie. Do 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 do. I'm fine with it, man. I'm fine with it. His ultimate is down. You don't scare me, you butt ugly fuck. Damage boys. Luckily, I jumped away in time. Nice we did a hell of a lot of damage to that Phoenix. Not bad. How much is it, Javal? Twelve fifty. I need to double my gold, pretty much. I mean, Ichabal would fuck him up like really bad, which is good. I don't know why he would just let me do that. He didn't even contest. Like, he went for the minion wave. I was ready to fight. Like, <laughs> but he just didn't... He didn't even care. That was weird. Okay, well... Let's see how much worshippers we get. And then end the video. Let's see how it's calculated. 52! So it is doubled. Holy shit! I just got 52 worshiper boosters. Okay, I figured it out. It's absolutely doubled because I just finished a 17 minute um, dual game and got 52 worshippers. Yeah, normally I'd get like 26 from the game and my booster made it 52 so the sum of the booster plus base okay so it's 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 base worshipers times three added to it so in this case 
because I got 26 from the game on triple worshippers, um, what's 26 divided by fucking 4? I don't even know. 8? Is that 8? 8? No, that's 32. 7? That's 28. 6? That's 24. So it's 6. So 6 plus 6 times 3, which is 18, equals 24. No, because I have 26. I got 26. How the fuck is it calculated? Do you get point? Do you get like 6 point something? I don't know. Either way, I just finished this fucking game and got 52 worshippers. That's incredible. Run, press 1, run, press 1. You're Bacchusura. What the fuck are you talking about? You do the same thing only with your 2 instead of 1. Like, what? Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure to share the video around. Let sh everyone shows or everyone sees the movie. Um, until next time, guys. Peace.